All right, today we're doing a video on my top two sites for buying and selling CSGO skins. Now, these are two sites that you can withdraw uh, your balance for real money. So if you, say, are just getting bored of CSGO skins, you know, you just sell them on either of these sites and you can withdraw. But some have, they both have different pros and cons, different methods, like payment methods, everything like that. All right, all right, let's get into the first one. Now, first off, we have Bitskins. This is a huge site, a lot of people use it. A lot of skins are being sold on here and a lot of buyers actually use the site. Now, one of the downsides of this site is that it takes a 10% fee whenever you're selling. So you will be making less profit. However, if you're just looking to get rid of your skins like as fast as possible and just get your money and go, this is definitely your site. Because, you know, I mean, the more you mark it down, you know, it's already got 10% off. And then if you mark it down more in price, you know, you're looking at like a really fast sale. A lot more skins get sold on this site than like m most others. I'd say that this is definitely one of the largest sites that you can use and one of the best. But in terms of payment methods where you can actually withdraw, if you get a balance, you know. Uh, for withdrawals, we have a lot of cryptocurrencies, or not a lot, but three cryptocurrencies, Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Litecoin. However, the downside to this is you have to do the KYC procedure to actually, this is know your customer procedure, where uh, you have to send them, like, a utility bill. So you do have to be 18, I believe, to actually, like, complete this. So you can actually withdraw money, and... So if you're not comfortable with going through that, you can't withdraw from this site. And actually, this is on the other site, but just to let you know that this is like something that you need to do if you want to withdraw. But three different uh, payment method or withdrawal methods. Visa card is very easy to use. Uh, and uh, you know, if you just want Bitcoin because cryptocurrencies, yay, then it's pretty easy to do. But in terms of deposits, we also have all those three same plus uh, Bitcoin coupons and you can sell your skins instantly from uh, your Steam inventory directly to the site. However, they take a pretty big like cut actually when you instant sell. Like it's, it, I, I just wouldn't recommend that. Yeah, my knife is not $142, so. If you're gonna do that, I mean, you can, but I, I, I would just sell your skin and take a little more money because there is still high foot traffic, so you will sell it pretty fast. That's about it for this site. Uh, on to the next one. Now there's Skinport. This site has uh, lower foot traffic for skin, so there are less being buy, uh, less buyers and sellers on this site. However, if you put uh, skinport.com into your name, I know people on skinport.com is there, you do get uh, only a 5% selling fee. So, and that's half of what you can get on Bitskins. So you can make more money, however, it takes a l way longer time to sell on this site. So if you just want more money in, in your sale, you know, use this site, of course, but Bitskins does, you will sell at a way higher rate like i don't know it's probably 10 times the amount of, or like seven times the amount of sales on bitskins than on skinport so if you're willing to wait and just get like maximum profit on your sale skinport is definitely the one to use they have a really nice they have a very good like site there's i haven't encountered any bugs with it at all like at all I mean, they just, it's, it's a really good site, however, it's just going to take much longer to sell your skin. Now, for uh, here, if we go to a seller account, this is what you had. You still have to do the KYC procedure, the know your customer procedure, for actually being able to withdraw your money from your balance on Skinport. And, but the only thing that I would say is a downside for withdrawing, other than putting personal information, like... I mean, they have to do that really because they don't want to be have any like legal loopholes or lose money or anything like that. You know, have any scammers doing anything. They have to make it very secure for everyone to use. But so 
that's why they have the KYC. But the only thing, the only way that you can actually withdraw money through this uh, site is through bank, a bank account, a bank transfer. So that is the only way. Bitskins has all those cryptocurrencies and cards. This is only bank transfer. So if you're completely fine with that, you you can get it set up easily. You know, you're good to go. Once you, once you have the KYC procedure complete, you are all good. So, and I don't I don't actually know if they take a small like fee when you withdraw, but it's pretty easy once you have that procedure completed. So it's a good site. Just longer to takes longer to sell than Bitskins and but you will make more money most likely unless you of course want to mark it down more in price so you can sell it faster this is about it i mean it also has Ruskins, dota 2 team fortress 2 but I, i'm assuming that you'd be going for csgo skins so they do have a pretty large market still but much slower so these are the two sites that i would recommend you use i mean there are other sites however these are two big ones. Uh, definitely, uh, Bitskins is definitely the much larger one. Both have good designs. Very few like bugs. Uh, you don't really encounter any bugs with these sites because you know you're using money, so they don't want to get sued or anything, or like have people lose money because that would be bad for the site and action and like appearances. So both very secure sites. You just have to go through the KYC procedure and then you can withdraw your money. So really up to you, whichever one you want to use. I use Bitskins more, but you know it, it, it's really your choice. So I hope you have enjoyed the video. I mean, it was just meant to be quick, tell you which, uh, like give you a little overview of each site and withdrawal features and how you do it. So uh, that's about it and have a great day. Bye-bye.